just talked to some guys. They got me on the phone with Carolina's coach. I'm gonna be here tomorrow training Jiu Jitsu with Carolina. <laughs> Who's the boss now? If you don't try, you don't know. Yeah. Previously on Tinder Surfing Adventures. It has been 30 minutes, still no answers for anyone. First one, not replying. If I can't find the host, maybe I just get like a hostel. Not a sleep on the bridge. <laughs> Anyway, lads, I'm not here for the Tinder. I'm here to find Karolina Kovalkiewicz. Either I date her, either I fight her. But I find her. That sounds good. Nice. So for those of you who do not know who's Karolina Kovalkiewicz, well, she's a UFC fighter. She fought everywhere around the world. She fought in Brazil, she fought in New York, Madison Square Garden, same card as always superstar Conor McGregor. She's obviously an amazing fighter, but, but well, what I like most about her is just that smile she's got on her face, man. She's just so pretty and so natural. Just love it. I know she's from Wuch, I know she trains in Wuch, so I thought, no, I'm done there, why not just try to meet her? That's it. So I just realized that Carolina Skovakiewicz gym in 10 min is 10 minutes away from where I am right now so I'm gonna go and check there maybe I found her maybe she can provide me accommodation or a coach or something like that that would be great let's go lads gonna pack up currently walking on my way to Carolina Kovalkiewicz gym octopus gym should be here around the corner hopefully some good news from there we'll see Alright lads, I made this. This is Octopus Gym. Getting in. Hey, chest. Nie rozumiem polskiego. Yeah, we can speak English. Ah, okay, perfect. Uh, I'm from Belgium and mm -hmm. I'm doing now a road trip uh, only with Tinder. And okay. I know that uh, Carolina, yes. she 20. Yes, she, she does. Do you think it's possible to see her maybe tomorrow when she trains? Well, I, I, I came to Wuj just to see her. She is uh, for me amazing. Okay. So now that I was in Poland, uh, uh -huh. I thought that I would come here and maybe have a photo or something. With her. Okay. Yes. Uh, I don't know if she will be here uh, tomorrow. How long are you going to stay in Wuj? Uh, until uh, Sunday. Uh, okay. For a second, because there is her, her spark partner. You may ah, know okay. her from this video blog. Kasia uh, Sadura. Yes, yes. From so uh, you see. After the training, okay. you can ask her. If maybe okay, she... so okay, yeah, I can sit with you. Ah, oh, perfect. Thank you, guys. Octopus Gym, the best in the business. The guy made like some phone call, and he got me on the phone with Karina's head coach. Bah! And tomorrow I have to come at night to train Jiu Jitsu, and I'll meet Karina. Oh, I'm so happy. So fuck Tinder. I'm just going to a nice hotel rest stop. And tomorrow, train Jiu-Jitsu with some motherfucking UFC almost champion. Same card as Conor McGregor and tomorrow I train with her. BAF! Get that! My motto is, if you don't try, you don't know. I tried, I know I know. Okay, it stopped raining now, but I think I got a bit too much like carried away. I want to go to hotel. It was like crazy expensive for what they were offering. No, I am walking to another one. Okay, okay, we just checked in in the hotel. Gonna have a good night of sleep with Justina. Thank you, Justina. Thank Amazing, you. I have Wi-Fi wi password, the key. Gonna sleep well and tomorrow train with Carolina. Nice. Thank you, Justina. <laughs> Lads, as you could see, at the end I made it. Got a nice cheeky hotel room. We're gonna rest. We're gonna go and do that. See you tomorrow. Fuck. So currently on my way to Octopus Gym. A quick reminder what the deal is. I go there, I take a free Jiu Jitsu class with some Polish dude. 
and after that Karina start training and I can get a picture with her but I haven't done all that just for a picture so I'm gonna try you know, to spy her, to fight her, to ask her for coffee, anything if you don't try you don't know I am literally shitting myself right now when I popped in the gym yesterday it was only big Polish muscle dudes and I trained Jiu-Jitsu for two months in Chile and I'm so bad at doing that so I feel like I'm gonna get killed or something or submitted like millions of times bro just walked in shit is on what happened next is just pure history folks remember what I said right Big Polish muscle dudes. Well, one of these guys turned out to be Marcin, aka the Polish zombie. Marcin is the KSW featherweight champion. He was in the UFC, Ultimate Fighter. He was part of Team McGregor. We shared a few rounds. Needless to say, I couldn't survive more than 10 seconds. But you know, rolling on the mats with the UFC fighter, what a broad experience. Loved it. Cheers for the tips, brother. Classic post training pick to, you know, I gotta take care of my Instagram game, right? Training is done. Carolina walks into the gym, and now it's time for the moment you've all been waiting for. Just keep this in mind. So I'm gonna try you know, to spy her, to fight her, to ask her for coffee, anything. Ready? Let's do this. Okay, and look who I found here in. Beautiful watch. I've been training with the guys. You can see I'm really sweaty. And I did it. I found Carolina. <laughs> Carolina says hello. Uh, that's it. Do you want to tell something to badge of Carolina? Uh... <laughs> no, okay. Uh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, I know that was bad. And for those of you who know me, for those of you who've been watching all the episodes, you know, I'm usually like cold, calm, composed, confident as a motherfucker. And there, I just couldn't say anything. I was just like, uh, my name is Potato. I just wanted so badly to tell her so many things and just couldn't. Anyway, Carolina, if you ever see this, massive thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you so much. Thanks to all the Octopus team, President, Marching, Zabor, everyone. That's an experience I will never never forget Jenkuye. I put the name below just make sure you go and follow them if you're ever in Wuch, Octopus Gym the best in the business trust me that's the end of our Tinder Surfing Adventures I hope you guys enjoyed as much as I did just want to say a massive thank you to all my hosts all the people I had the chance to meet during this trip a massive shout out to all my real G's all my friends and family who've been with me Day one. A tout grand merci à Samian aussi, sans qui cette aventure n'aurait pas pu être possible. This crazy journey and this last episode is the evidence that whatever dream you have in life, even if, this, if it is the weirdest dream ever, if you work for it, if you believe in it, you will succeed, kids. Never stop believing, trust me. The YouTube channel is not over. I have crazy ideas, lovely new videos coming might not be every Sunday but still the YouTube channel is only getting started make sure you subscribe never forget if you don't try you don't know see you soon what's up